This is uh, the khichdi. So khichdi is basically rice and lentil that is cooked together. And then I've got uh, this whole map of India laid down here with 20 different ingredients on it. So each of the ingredients holds a certain value to the place it's coming from. And I will be adding these to a khichdi one by one. Starting off with saffron from Kashmir. Green apples from Himachal Pradesh. We've got butter from Punjab. Pickling spices from Rajasthan. Papaya chutney from Gujarat. Some peanut techa from uh, Maharashtra, Mumbai. We've got sesame seeds from Chhattisgarh. Curry leaves from Karnataka, black pepper from Kerala, this is a solid leaf pickle, nice and spicy and it's from Andhra Pradesh. What is that, soil leaf? Sorrel leaf. Okay, sorrel. Sorrel, it's made with uh, red sorrel, Indian red sorrel. And then we've got uh, gunpowder or pori. Tamil Nadu. This is a uh, biryani seasoning from uh, Hyderabad, Telangana. We've got chena in the form of cottage cheese from Odisha. What is it? Uh, ch it's uh, cottage cheese. Oh, okay. it's homemade cheese. cottage cheese. Yeah. Also. Then we've got uh, chana jor garam. That's it. That is black gram that is flattened out and then made into a crisp. It's from uh, Bihar. Some spring onion from Arunachal. This is fermented chili paste from Assam. Next up, I've got uh, ghee from Haryana. This is clarified butter. Some mustard oil from Bengal. from uh, Madhya Pradesh and lastly we have some raw mangoes from Uttar Pradesh so we are going to mix everything together and uh, serve it to you sorry another little translation of kitri is a mixture of many ingredients or many things so with this one dish uh, we wanted to showcase the diversity of Indian food now a simple uh, thing like rice and lentil can change from a uh, particular region to region depending upon what ingredients they have. And I also don't want you to be empty handed from my kitchen counter. <laughs> okay. So I will humbly uh, give this bowl of kitchen.